the holidays, one of the most beloved times of year. Cereal, one of the most beloved breakfast foods. What happens, though, when one man eats nothing but holiday-themed cereal for an entire day? Well, one thing's for sure. We don't have to ho, ho, hold on, because we're about to find out. What's happening everybody? Eric here, back at you with a brand new video. Now, in this video, my stomach's gonna be diving right into the holiday spirit as I'm gonna be eating nothing but holiday themed cereals for the next 24 hours. Yes, so that means for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, I'm gonna be eating nothing but the finest holiday cereals I can find. But you know what? I got to thinking, I know it does happen every so often, and I'm not quite sure if one box is gonna be enough. After all, I am a growing boy. So we're gonna double down, and I'm gonna be having two boxes at every meal. So that is a total of six boxes for the day, yes. But anyways, that's enough talking for me. I'm getting pretty hungry here. So I think we're gonna get started with this sugar cookie toast crunch. All right. The unboxing for all you lovely folks. Always the best part. Try to get the biggest bowl I could find. This is the biggest bowl I had, so. Almond milk. Unsweetened, balance some calories out, health and fitness, as always. I'm gonna pour this. Oh, oh that just went everywhere. Don't go there. <laughs> and then, if I need it, mammoth mug full of water. But we're gonna dive in. Oh, there's milk everywhere. All right. Cheers. Oh yeah. Ooh, that is good. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite holiday themed cereal is. Because depending on where you're at in the world, I know I'm very limited here in Canada. I bet you there's a lot more options depending where you're at in the world. So let me know in the comments below what your favorite one is. I'm not gonna really be able to show it to you guys, but I really like, yeah, you're not gonna see it. it's gonna go everywhere. A little bit too much milk. But the good news is we got a lot more cereal, so we're good. I don't know about you, but the sugar cookie's starting to hit a little. So I'm feeling pretty jolly. Let's see how I feel halfway through the Rice Krispies. All right, not much left here. Oh. When the box goes down, that means it's done. Down for the count. Yeah, that should be better. Nice little mix. I'm gonna be honest, I feel like Cinnamon Toast Crunch essentially has like so many different variants. Like sugar cookie, I don't know, there's like apple pie, and so many different kinds of like cinnamon. I think there's like honey ones. They gotta be one of the cereals out there with the most variants, like the most different types of ways you can change it and alter it. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. Huh. 
I can't tip it too much, but just so you guys can see. The funny thing is, is once this is done, I'm going to the gym still. Oh, my hand has just been like sitting in this milk. Gross! Oh. All right, this one's almost done. All right, lock well done. So time to dive into the Rice Krispies Holiday Edition. Very cool. All right. Let's try not to overdo it on the milk this time. So cool. All right. Round two. So it's good. It's Rice Krispies. Definitely could use a little something, but that sugar cookie toast crunch was really sweet, so. A little bit more milk. Bottom of this is starting to kind of taste like oatmeal. Texture, yeah. Not really a fan of soggy cereal. Comment below and let me know if you're a fan of soggy cereal for some reason. Sure, some people are. But each their own. Okay, so obviously Rice Krispies, they just like absorb like all the moisture because now there's like zero milk in here i feel like i should have known that but oh by the way for our present time so 10 16 you can see the date there as well i don't even know what the date is tuesday november 29th there you go not a lot left here, but still a good amount here. Uh, they're still very deceiving, Rice Krispies. Okay, a little bit of debris in there, but it's pretty much done. So, do have obviously a little bit left, the Rice Krispies. Stomach capacity is, is full right now. So, because this obviously isn't a food challenge, there are no rules that say I obviously fail or, you know, pass if I eat everything or fail if I don't. But what I'm gonna do is tack this on to one of the other two meals do my best to finish this off by the end of the day. But yeah, one and three quarters of boxes down. Pretty good way to start the day. Got a nice little sugar buzz happening here. So I'm gonna go hit the gym. So I'll see you guys in a few hours for lunch.
Alrighty, folks, welcome back. You're just in time. Lunch is about to be served in the form of Captain's Holiday Crunch and Kellogg's Elf on the Shelf. Well, without further ado, we're gonna get started. Not much else has changed. Got the almond milk, mammoth mug full of water that I'll probably not drink. And for time update, it is currently 1.34. Same date, as you can see there. And we're gonna get started with the Holiday Crunch. Cheers. So I'm not gonna lie, it's been a while since I've had Captain Crunch. Here's the thing that I noticed with Captain Crunch though. As good as it is, and it is good, it's hard to eat quickly. And I always found which, you know, let me know in the comments below if it's the same for you. But it's so like hard, you're almost afraid it's gonna like rip your gums apart or like the roof of your mouth. Mm. Corn and oat cereal. Who knew? <laughs> I will say though, the nice thing about Captain Crunch is the density of the cereal itself, because it's so like hard and crunchy, it doesn't get all soggy like the Rice Krispies and stuff did. All right, there's still a little bit left in here. I can't tip it, you guys will see it. You guys won't see it, It'll, you'll just see it like waterfall cascade of almond milk all over my floor, which is probably funny for you to see, but not funny for me to clean up, so. Huh. Let's finish this off. Get the rest of that catman in here. Ooh, that was a lot more than I thought. All done. Rule from the first one, when it is complete, Box goes down. All right. Oof. Oh, my mouth is going to be so tender by the end of this. <laughs> Just so crunchy. Gotta be about. Ah, oh, gross! Half word, give a take. So, as you guys know, with any really sugary cereal, the issue is the milk basically turns into like uh, sugar milk. There's no real break from the sweetness. All right, let's dive into this elf on the shelf. Holiday cereal, vanilla flavor. Okay. Oh, it's got like little marshmallows and stuff in it. I've truthfully never, I've seen this cereal before, but I've never had it, so. Time to dive in. Oh. Okay. Try another bite. Oh. 
Hold on. No. Wanted to make sure I didn't grab like expired or something. That is a weird flavor of vanilla. It's supposed to be vanilla flavored. This is not good. Oh. I don't know if I got a bad batch. It's just like got this weird aftertaste to it. Like, I can't explain. You look at this and you think like, oh, sugary deliciousness. Like the cereal's mostly green. If you made it like a Grinch cereal, I would get the joke that like, ha ha ha, it's actually terrible. Cause I hate Christmas and holidays. Cause I'm the Grinch. I get it. But uh, Guys, I do not get this. If you guys have ever had this cereal, comment below and let me know if you like it. And also comment below and let me know if you know like what flavor this tastes like. Maybe I just got a bad batch, I don't know. All right, well, this is what I'm gonna do. Bowl's almost done. Not done. I know there's like still half the bag left. The cereal. This is not good. So what I'm gonna do, I'll add this to the little bit of Rice Krispies and have either a little bit of dessert after dinner, which will be the last two boxes on the day, or I might just do the, the Rice Krispies and just say no go with these. I'm not really doing a ranking on any of this, but just, I don't recommend this elf on the shelf unless I got a bad batch. I don't know, you guys can let me know, but that's it for lunch. Gonna go probably for a nice long walk, maybe a few hours or so. So we'll see you back here in a little bit for dinner. See you soon. Alrighty folks, well, Sun's going down, so that must mean it's about dinner time. And I'm gonna give you guys a quick update before we get started. I made an executive decision. I'm not gonna be finishing off the Rice Krispies and the Elf on the Shelf cereals that I didn't get through in the previous two meals. Just decided that, well, well the Elf on the Shelf was not good whatsoever. I have still two full boxes here that I need to get through. But I know what you're saying to yourselves, Eric, come on, what's going on? You didn't finish it off. You're right, but to make up for it, I'm gonna be sprucing up. As you see, I've got a box of Sugar Cookie Toast Crunch here again. I actually had a hard time finding more than five boxes of cereal that were holiday flavored. So what I'm gonna do, spruce things up a little and introduce some holiday shaped chocolate chips. How, baby? <laughs> so this should make things a little bit interesting, but we're gonna get started with the Sugar Cookie Toast Crunch here. Sugar cookie toast crunch. Say that 10 times fast, I swear. That's the biggest tongue twister that there is. Anyways, crack this open, get started. Well, we still got some daylight out. Let's get her going. Cheers. If I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys, surprising, or maybe not surprising to you, I'm not all that hungry right now. <gasps> uh, I'll give you guys a time update too. It's not that late. It's uh, 4.49. Couldn't see the same date there. But to be honest, it gets dark very early here and I still haven't figured out lighting to, you know, look as good as natural light for filming. So something that's still on in the works for me, but. All right, so I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below if you guys enjoy having cereal at different times of the day other than in the morning. Or that's lunch or dinner time, like right now. Let me know in the comments below. Uh, 
or vote. All right. Bowl number two. Sugar cookie. Yes, please. I still eat you a little bit more. It goes in my stomach till it can't fit no more. Yeah. Huh. Like half left. Oh, as quick as it came, it's gone yet again. My energy. The water's like not really refreshing at all. Just the sugar, just it's like quicksand. Energy quicksand just brings you down. Oh. A couple of bugs left. I'll sprinkle some of these on here. Not sure if you guys will be able to see them, but let me do so you guys can see that. Hopefully you can. It's pretty cool. Oh, jazz it up a little bit. Oh, all right, a couple more spoonfuls here. A little bit of debris, but what's the last bite here? Hey. Right. That's all down. Okay. Might as well call me CEO, Eric, because I'm making another executive decision right now. I'm not having this box of Crispix. I'm gonna be honest with you, it's not even really like holiday. It's just got like some, you know, decorations on the box that make it look more holiday. I think it's just the plain Crispix like Czech cereal. You guys know I don't really like to waste food. So I'm not gonna open this knowingly. I'll probably get maybe a bowl out of it if I'm lucky. Cause I'm just, I'm tapped out at this point. So I'm not gonna be taking that down, but make up for it. There was three boxes that I didn't technically finish out of the six that I started out with for each meal. I started two of those boxes, but I didn't finish them. So I'm gonna do three spoonfuls of these chippets for each one of our quote unquote failed attempts, I guess. One. Okay. Can I actually taste the chips now? Of course I couldn't. Very like pepperminty. Hmm. Two. Three. Need a quick sip of water here. Wow, almond milk is almost almond the way gone. <laughs> oh, all right. Well, cereals are all down. What's gonna be put down is all down of it. So that is gonna be a wrap for this video. Hopefully I made you guys proud. Did the best that I could. Like I said, the very beginning, this isn't a food challenge. Uh, I just wanted to eat as much cereal as I could. And the whole point of this video was for me to eat nothing but Christmas holiday themed cereal for the whole day. And that's what I did. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed it, but that is gonna be a wrap for this video. So as always, thank you so, so much for watching. I genuinely appreciate it. 
please just remember to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Toss this video a good old fashioned thumbs up if you liked it. And be sure to hit that channel bell for notifications so that you never miss a new video of mine. And we'll see you in the next video.